Hello, welcome to our episode of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I hope you're enjoying this playthrough as much as I'm enjoying playing this game. And now let's go ahead and head into our episode. There we go. Now we're just gonna head in that direction. So we're getting ambushed at the feast. Gotcha. I am actually because to bosses I can switch to this. I want to try this one out. Give it some food. I do not have enough block room. I never thought I would sit. Alright, we'll keep it unruined then. Actually, mm. dealing with a lot of uh, yeah, it's the poison cloud. You know what? Let's try that. This is fallen enemy. If that affects me. Let's see how wrong this game is. What are your plans for Essex and your family? You promised we would never be apart, not for one waking or sleeping moment, and already you're sneaking out to hunt. <laughs> for the feast, sweetling. We owe our mutual friend a great debt, one that I promised to repay over suckling pig and ale. Sister, have you forgotten where you are? I have a right to happiness outreach. Or am I to play nursemaid forever, you ungrateful pup? Happiness, yes. But you embarrass yourself nightly, heaving and sweating with this hamhock. Hold your tongue, boy. Lest we both speak our truths. What truth have you to speak? That you've returned to this fickle man who abandoned you years ago for a Frankish pet? A woman he paid this dame to abduct in that lamish shadow play? Mind yourself, boy. Or that you let him sniff and paw you and take him to your bed on the promise of nothing? The whole of Essex whispers now. He's married still, his wife freshly stolen, and you are no more than... Is... I am the mother of his child, you whelp! Child? Alvida? Yeah. Knew it! Ah! I called it! Please, my boy, I... I... I will never forgive you for this. Never! That's the boy. <laughs> my lord, joyous news! God smiles upon us this very day. Estrid has been found by Alfred's men. They ride to her rescue as we speak. Right. I will not let this plot be undone. Nothing is safe till they are away to Frankia. I will fix this, and one day I will call on you, and you will come. You can count on it, my friend. Wow. Well, I, I wanted to tell you so many times. Hush, Angel. Do not fret. Rolo. Rolo. Here again. But we have a fast travel point here, so yay for that. Estrid is so close to freedom. I hope I'm not too late. Astrid. He's right there. Alright, that's good. Rolo! Alfred's men have found you! 
What? How can this be? Lork, stand by Estrid. Guard her with your life. If she's taken, all is lost for us and Beeston. Come, lady. It would not do for them to take you back. Watch out! Lork! Oh! So that's what happens. If you choose the wrong one, they step out of the way. Release the woman, Danes! The if she's unarmed, we strength. may let some of you... Here come the bastards! Oh, that's a big boy. Oh, he's on our side. Sweet. Kill Saxon. I can do this. Kill Saxons all day. That is not an issue. Stop that ship from sailing. Down. Hold on, get him up. Big boy. Ah. Ah, that's what I was afraid of. Run! Run! Get out of there! Get up Oh, I... Actually, you're, you're dead, dude. You're on fire. Not dead. Good news, you survived the fire. How, but you did. My sand saver. Get up. Oh, I want the big guy up. Nice. Estrid, I promised I would free you of your life in Wessex. Frankia awaits your return. Go now, with Aegir's blessing. I will miss you, Eivor. When winter is past, summer will come, and wind you in a flowered skirt. For you are beauty, and shall not wither. Goddess Freya, give me more of that. Come, take care of her, Rollo Stoutheart. And if you find yourself on England's shores again, I will expect you in my hall. And there is a tongue on Eivor. Good. They are safe. Now what? Birsten got his end of the bargain, and Estra is to Frankia. I should return to Ranvi. Oh shit, that's it. All right. Uh, 
right. Well. So, let's spend some points and skills real quick. So, we are literally running out of stuff to buy. Crit chance over there. Damage. Hold on. Damage. You know what? Try to grab the help. Go ahead and fast travel back to town. Wrong beat. Wrong town. There we go. And sell our shit. And buy some metal. In order, sell our shit, buy some metal, up to run. Alright. Shit. Andre, I don't think we got any. Oh, we got some. Tungsten. Could do the boots. Do the boots room. Boots, felt it. Ronji. Rain fart. I would like to see. You have a keen eye for quality. For armor. You are look. I must be on my way. Put that gear to good use. Spoon in there. More armor. I are tank. May I see your stores? Always a pleasure doing business, Eivor. I already have one of those. I don't think I need another. You but know again, you have use for this. A metal. Iron ore. Maybe titanium. A lot. This was How much a smart is, purchase. How much is the titanium? Yeah, buy all five. Alright, now let's go I talk to Ronnie. Always a pleasure, Eva. Alright. Take it up to you later, Petra. Ronfi? Two letters? Go ahead and just start Lincolnshire right away. Quat tidum the Eivor. In Essex, I play the matchmaker and the heartbreaker. An easy way to forge an alliance. But let us stick to war and diplomacy. Understood. Thank you, Eivor. Right. Money. I want to see the Alliance map. All right, Lincolnshire. What about Lincolnshire? A rather boisterous man named Hunwald arrived recently, wishing to speak with Oh, I think we you. know this. Where is he now? Down at the docks, carousing. Letters to Lincolnshire. He sounds charming. I will meet him at once. Protect your ears. Right. Cloak. And it's it's export duty. How bad could it Interesting. I think the uh Yggdrasil allows fruit to grow better. More fruit faster, that sort of thing. 
Where are you? The Hunwald. Hunwald! Hey, this is true happiness, isn't it, men? You may think this odd, but our lively chatter here has inspired in me a short poem. May I recite it for you? Go on, Merrick. Lord the Boy. Make me tremble. Oh, indeed, I shall try. I call it Ode to a Hungry Flame. Another skull come to join us? Me? Oh, goodness, no. I'm no scald, no. Just a humble nobleman with an interest in versification. An amateur, really. Shall I continue? I'm not here to judge your poems, Lord. Speak your purpose, or down your meat. Y yes Pizza. Sorry. Pizza. I have come with the hope of meeting Eivor, the great warrior of this clan. If such an audience is possible. Who are you? You must understand that Eivor has more enemies than friends in Mercia, Lord. Before I drag you off by your knob to meet her, I would like to know your name. Yes, forgive me. I am Hundwald, loyal son of Lord Hunbeor, the current elderman of Lincolnshire. May God keep and cure him. Sure. You see, my father is ailing, and in his delirium, evil men have corrupted his judgment. A secret and powerful order. Oh, if the whispers we're are true. Him out. Only a month ago, without forewarning, Mercian soldiers chased me, his only son, from my home. I know not why, but I do know my father would never have ordered my exile. Outcast from your family, that is a hard road to walk. Could one of your clan help me return to Lincoln? March beside me through the city gates and set me at my father's noble feet once again. It may be we can help you, but we'll want something in return. An alliance between our clan and yours. And you shall have it. My father is a great friend of the Danes, in spite of the recent wars. You sing a sad song, Hunwald of Lincolnshire. A son robbed of his father's protection. Now desperate to prove his honor. How far will you go to regain it? To a bloody end? Oh, indeed. I will plunge into the heat of He's battle never to fought. defend my father, knowing our cause is a righteous one. All right, young lord. My clan has need of me just now. But when I'm ready, we'll find your father together and right the wrongs you've suffered. Ah, you are the chieftain here. I suspected as much. The armor? God praise you, Eivor. I won't be leading you into the heart of a shield wall. But there will be danger. I want your word. You will follow my orders to the rune. I am yours to abuse. If it comes to that. I'll wait for you in my safe haven, Bottleston to the northeast. From there, we shall make our way to Lincoln. Goodbye, Lord Boy. Safe travels. God bless and keep you all. I fear I may be escorting that boy to his own execution. That might shut him up. Huh. Right. Well, hopefully he doesn't die. But uh, let's see where this goes. Unwell. World. Hey, for fast travel. Wow, wait, he... It's not like it's going to be super hard to get. Not sure why it did that. Oh, down. There we go. Oh, no. 
Oh. There you go. Oh. Oh. You just swum to it. Can't well. Come on, next one's in this direction. I know where it is. Go Over there. My eyes. I didn't even see what I got. I doubt it was anything really good. They're on the inside. Ah, we're gonna have to fight for it, aren't we? Oh, shit. No, we're not. Hi, boys. Hi, boys. What? Say something? Alright, on to the next one. One. Going or crawling. Alright, so that that one I'm probably gonna have to come. We should on lava too. Just gonna find off the So this is Windwell's safe haven. There will be a mercy in Shire today. Tomorrow, the kingdom of Lindsay will rise again. As free as the wind on the back of my neck. Uh, I do have a choice. I'm going to have to trigger him right away. What in Lincolnshire now? Do you need a map to remember? Algar, my dear man. I do not need a map to prove what my bones know for truth. Oh, well, that... There we go. That's... Yes. Silver and supplies. I'm stuck. Wait, wait. Where, where are you going? Ivor, Ivor, where are you going? There we go. Where you had Unwald, who is this stranger? Ivor, come sit. I don't trust him already. Bread and ale, please, alewife. I have been discussing my delicate situation with Alvgar here. Alvgar. Lord. He is a nobleman like me. One of Lincolnshire's sturdy thanes. Hmm. Hunvold's idea of sturdy is a mug of ale that won't tip over. Alvgar has pledged his loyalty to my family, the House of the Ferocious Swan. Um, well? With his influence and your might, we shall rid Lincolnshire of the ruffians who plague this land, once and for all. We're going right. to see your father, Hunwald. That's all. Indeed, Eivor. With speed and purpose, you are the axle to my wheel, the spark to my tinder. Aww. We have a plan. Hunwald, your father is ill, and your enemies have every advantage under the sun. Do you have a plan, or have I come all this way to watch you drink this watery piss? Of course, my friend. I am a man of action above all else, ready to leap and dance and fight. Listen, I've come to escort you to your father's side. We go now, or I walk. Ah, yes, to Lincoln. Away, but with care. The road between here and there is teeming with brigands who wish me dead. Like the two behind us. A single dame will not protect you against the whole of Mercia's army. 
My butt says I could take them all. I think you're wrong, Alvgar. And here she'll prove it. I'm hot for a fight, Snowdog. Give me half a chance, I'll stove your heathen face right in! What fight? All right, a quick brawl to get familiar with the local dregs. I could have talked my way out of it, but one thing twice about it. What was that? Welcomes us more into the day than a swift closing. Is this what it means to be your friend? We shall triumph, Avor. We shall that is just a weird attack style. You're losing ground, you do. Avor, my bladder is bursting. I must step outside for a long deserved. Clear out, all of you, before you kick up a fire. Jesus, my bones are aching. Could use a dip in the sea. Shut your hinge, chill. And stop dripping blood in my hall. <laughs> I told Hunwald to stay near. Where did he wander off to? Sounded like Hunwald. He went out that side ah. door. Oh, shit. Well, these guys are all dead. What's in trouble? They call this pasty whelp a lord. Look at him. Soft as unbaked bread. Villains, leave me be. You're going down. Leave him be. Your time's up, sir. Jesus, he's brought up bloody days. This is oh, the I have been struck. Yeah, all he knows about fighting, he's read in store. I live! I am alive! Heaven have mercy! Are you hurt? Unbelievable! The Battle of Bottleston will be remembered for years to come! Alfgar, we have won our first great victory! He Who died to put Alfgar in the throne. Never better, I... We should get to Lincoln as quickly as we can. Yes, yes, you're right. Let's depart. Right. What horrible souls oh. are hunting me? Me, the son of a beloved elderman. Was it naive of me to believe my status as a nobleman held some sway over the Chairals? Oh and shit, Sir's he's riding with me. All right, so we can't what fast travel. have any to dishonor me? Look, boats there. We could sail the waters to Lincoln, sink the ships of any enemies in our way. Going? Oh, quite literally up the road. And yeah, let's 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 do what this were you in told style. That the guards exiled you. Oh, scraps of nonsense! I woke to screaming. A man grabbed me, said I was an immediate danger to my father. Horse, okay. Mercian soldiers then shackled me, rode me blindfolded to the river wash, and right. told me plainly. If you're gonna, if we're gonna use a boat, we're gonna use a boat. You swim. All right, good. Me, rode me blindfolded to the river wash and told me plainly, start a new elsewhere or face death in Lincolnshire. What did they mean? Oh, some nonsense about me praying for his death. Hungry for his inheritance. Where to God Speak if you're playing. Like I cannot help you if I don't know the full story. You hold no grudge against your father? No, never. No, I suspect the order for my exile came from on high. Perhaps one of Burgred's final orders before he was deposed. Burgred. That would surprise me. Burgred was battling Danes until the end. He had bigger things to worry over. Perhaps you're right. He's too contained. It must have been King Alfred then. King Alfred of Wessex? That's another kingdom entirely. He wouldn't care. Yes, but Alfred has a fearful hatred of the Danes. He must have heard that I am courting one. A beauty who knows no equal. Your Dane, lady love. Right. Right.
Yeah, we ain't raiding shit. Um. Huh. No song? No music? And this way, avoid any ambushes on the road. Who the hell's gonna attack a Viking longship? Oh. about tight heavy shield at least the bear stuff they walked away Ooh, grabbing that they should have done that with all the bear wolf locked it away had to actively go for it there we go shouldn't be seen better be hooded on You know what? We're not taking City the main dock. The cauldron of my present soul. We're up here, Hunwald. Hmm? Ah, smart kids. Persian guards everywhere. Follow me. Um. Right behind you. What? Shadow. My heart beats like the drums of your dragon boat. That. Where are you going? Okay, sure. Fine with. I hop this. How does this? Work? I hop, you follow? Cause him they won't bother. Okay, yeah. He just This town is your home? Teleport. It was and should still be. Oh to see it now fills my eyes with tears. Save weeping for prayers. We're not inside yet. One day I won't have to skulk around this town with my face hidden. I will walk proudly among the people I love. How was your father the last time you saw him? He was quite poorly, but he has the heart of a lion and the Holy Spirit itself within him. Him, they won't bother. Here we go. Come here, Hunwald. We're in. I have barely enough silver there we to go. buy Pete from those bandit smugglers. They hoard everything. Him, they won't bother. I just gotta be. Learned that with. Hunwald! Praise God, you live! I do, my dear Reagan hair. Body and soul. Tell my father his son has returned and in fighting form. It is urgent I speak with him. Yes. I'm sorry, Lord, but your father has been taken. Taken? Oh, when? kidnapped. Weeks ago, Lord. And well ill he was when they carried him off. I wish I could say more. Well, who took him? Who took the Elderman? Was it soldiers or men of God? There were men with swords and those of the cloth. And a healer too, one who had oft been a guest in this house. Galwina, one of the sisters my father put great faith in. He okay. still has friends in Lincoln. That's a good sign. Mm. Bishop Herivrith among them. He's kept a vigil at the town hall, looking after things in your father's absence until he returns. Will we find trouble there, at the town hall? You mean soldiers and the like? Aye, there have been many, many more about since your father took his leave. Right, we'll find a quiet way in if we can. Town hall! Do I have to really? I've got to look out. All right, so now we're heading this direction. He's an old fixture of my family's household, oh, loyal no. to the end. Anything. He helps run the Good. place, 
and he's known me since I was but a little lordling. A simple fellow, but worth every pinch of his salt. Not as simple as you think. That's the way these things... Above me? Ah, where are you going? Don't follow. Hold on. Back left corner. Son of a bitch. Alright, up we go. Alright, quite in. Yep, we're soldiers. We're good. Alright. No rushing. Any soldier. Wait a minute. Hold on. It keeps changing. There. That's where we gotta go. Thank you. This must be the town hall. Wait for Hunwald to get... Unwalled? Unwalled? Oh, son of a bitch! The one time he doesn't follow. That's what it is. He's not following. <gasps> Are you following now? There he is. All right. Oh. Need to go over the damn wall? I can just go through the damn wall. Lincoln seems a good place to trade. Does it? The market is flush with goods. Yes, it must be. Growing up, we never wanted for anything in my father's home. Bread and poultry and field fruits of all manner. I suppose this is where our servants purchased them. Lincoln's boom is ours. How often did you leave your house, Humboldt? Oh, there he from is. time to time. Yes. I <laughs> eat hardly ever. There we go. Alright, now we gotta work. Yeah, I pet <laughs> Tell Lord Hunbeor his son has returned. Dead. My lord, you're well. Dad of the Ren on it. Lord Hunward, we had no news of your return. You might have sent They're a messenger on it. and spared us the suspense. Why so surprised to see my return, Bishop? Was I rumored dead? Oh, worse than dead. It is my reluctant duty to report the rumor that you were lost in the north. Bedding a Dane on some squalid farm. I have no patience for insults and rumor. We've come to speak with Lord Hunbior. That's all. They're in on it. Lord Hunbior has gone, I'm afraid. He would not say where to, but I'm sure he will return shortly. Once the storm has passed. What on earth do you mean by that? What storm? Your father feared for his life, Unwald. In his weakened state, he could he not defend so himself. Not. not against the Dane, certainly. How dare you? Eivor is above reproach. See this from my view, Hunwald. You arrive after a strange absence, with a hired Viking in tow, demanding to see your father. This does not, in my estimation, imply benign intentions. Our coming here has nothing to do with you. This is a matter between the boy and his father. I disagree. 
everything this boy does concerns us. Yeah, He's they're the in on it. He's the of our elderman. I all but raised you, lad. Bounced you on my knee and taught you scripture. So when I tell you we don't know where your father is, nor why he left our hospice in his ailing state, it's because we don't know. Come, Abbas. We should leave this young lord to his scurrying thoughts. There is nothing more of use we can say to him. Ah, uh, ah. Uh? Take care, my boy. Or at least one of them isn't. Stay within these walls where you're safest. I will have a look around, see what I can learn about your father. If my father spent time at the hospice here, the healers who work there may know something. Talk to them if you can. Find out what they know. Oh no! Ah! Oh. So ends our adventure. Hello, this is Gohan the Chinchilla, and we hope you're having a good day, as do I. As always, we hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to follow, like, subscribe, or comment. Or even better, come on over to twitch.tv backslash sparkytdk and watch me live every Monday through Friday. Thank you for your support.